Hey guys, it's your favorite auntie. Um, so I have to talk about this Breakfast Club interview. So, you know, Crystal Renee, which is the ex-wife to the singer Neo, appeared on The Breakfast Club along with Tamika Foster, who is, I'm sorry, I think she's going by Tamika Raymond. She is the ex-wife of Usher Raymond. And they appeared on The Breakfast Club to, in my opinion, everything in this video is my opinion. It is alleged and it's for entertainment purposes only. So they appeared on the show to, in my opinion, revitalize Bold and Bougie. I had heard that the show was not doing very well. And so I think they're being sent out to try to promote the show. Well, um, Crystal showed up on the um, interview, in my opinion, dressed very classy and appearing very healed. Now, my issue with Tamika is that, yes, she definitely showed up very classy. She's always very classy in her appearance, but I was disappointed in her mindset. Um, I just would have thought by now, so much time has passed since her divorce, that she would be in a better state, in a more healed state. And the reason why I'm saying that I felt like she wasn't healed is because I was very taken aback to her response to Crystal when Crystal talked about how she found out how Neo cheated on her. And let me just play the clip, the audio clip, because I just was surprised at what Tamika is saying to her um, in this clip. And I'll know something. Yeah, I think I was just so surprised because being around y'all were like best friends. Like it wasn't just like. You know, everything wasn't always romantic. Like, they was cool. They, that was like, y'all were, like, real mm -hmm. best friends. Mm -hmm. You feel me? So That's what I'm saying. It's not worth it to leave. Well. Girl, what? I, well, wait. Well, wait. I, actually, I just. That, that, is, that is yeah. your disposition. That's true. Yeah. Mine, however, yeah. is different. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, no, okay. thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah Because yeah. I know my worth. And, I, and I'm not going to settle for just sharing somebody when I know I deserve a whole man. Right. So, right. What did y'all mean? I think I'm just older. We like. Okay, so there were two things that were said by Tamika um, in this audio clip. She said to Crystal, she didn't think it was worth it to leave when Jess brought up the fact that, oh my gosh, you and Neo, y'all just seem like best friends. Y'all just seem like such a good couple. People hear that all the time, but people don't know the intricate details of someone's relationship. It's been plastered all over the internet that Neo um, was not only involved with other women, but having children with other women while married to his ex-wife. Well, at the time, wife. And so for Tamika to sit there and say, well, it's not worth it to leave because y'all were best friends. Girl, what? And then she said, the second thing that um, was really important, she said at the end, um, I think I'm just older. And I'm assuming she's saying that's why she feels that way. Isn't this um, ironic? Because if you are a Love and Marriage Huntsville fan, then you know that Nell had the same thing, the same comments in regards to why Melody should have stayed with Martell. Now, I'm not going to make this video about them, but Nell had the same thing as to why she stayed with Fletcher because she's older. And I guess they are brought up that you just stay with your husband. That's just, it doesn't matter if they cheat on you, if they have a baby on you. Um, you're just supposed to just stay with them. But I love the fact that Crystal said, no, I know my work. I'm not settling and I'm not sharing my husband with someone else. That's what this whole channel is about. This is what I'm always preaching on this channel because you have the Tamikas of the world. Um, and it's not even just older generation. It is people, you know, younger and all ages in between that have this same sentiment that Hey, all men cheat. They're all going to do that. I am here to tell you, your auntie is here to tell you, all men do not cheat. Now, I know Charlamagne and DJ Emmy is not the ones you want to hear that from, but it is a fact that all men do not cheat. I know plenty of men um, that are in relationships with my friends, in my own personal situation, where they do not cheat. It's not true. And you have so many people, the Tamikas of the world, that really want you to believe that. Um, and they just really want you to settle. They want you to believe that, no, you're not going to find a good, wholesome man. And I love the fact that Crystal was like, no, I know my worth. And she would rather take the step out on faith and find out for herself is it a possibility for me to meet someone who actually is going to be faithful to me? And I love that. And I can't, I don't know what happened with Tamika to where she hasn't healed from 
her past relationship? Because I would have thought by now that after all of these years, you would have been in a different mindset and different space to know that um, all men um, do not cheat. There are some good men out there, and I don't know why she hasn't found one um, that could help her to change that uh, that thought and idea. And I'm glad that Crystal doesn't listen to people like Tamika who say, well, you know, that I, I guess I'm just older and I think it's just not worth it to leave. And I don't know, it could be because when she was with Usher, you know, they just had such a tumultuous relationship. I know that there was allegations that he slept with one of her bridesmaids um, and I think maybe even one of her other friends. Um, and so I don't know if she's just bitter from that. And ever since then, she's just like, and maybe her ex-husband before Usher, that she's like, no, there's no such thing as a good man. And I refuse to believe it. But it's not true. Your auntie's here to tell you it's not true. All men do not cheat. And um, please, please, please don't listen to the Tamikas of the world. Take that step out on faith. Know your worth. You come into the relationship as a good, wholesome person, you're going to meet somebody that's a good, wholesome person to match that. You just got to make sure you watch for these signs of some of these guys. Um, I know some people think that Crystal situation, that it was uh, sh shaky on how her and Neil got together. But I believe her. She's had the same story since day one, that Neil was not in a relationship when she met him. And, and I believe that, um, but set that aside and um, look at the bigger picture, the fact that she's saying that, you know what, I'd rather take my chances. She has three children and that she was bold enough, brave enough to say, you know, I'm not staying in a relationship with the guy who wants to be with all these women. And it's clear that's what Neo wants to do. He just want to run around with a bunch of different women. And maybe one day Tamika will meet her happily ever after. But I think she has to change her mindset first and then she'll meet who she's supposed to meet. But right now it seems like she's still kind of in a bitter space. But kudos to Crystal. And um, that is all I have for this video. So make sure you like, comment and subscribe. And let me know your thoughts about that. Um, drop it down in the comment section.